Hey guys, it's me, OP Games. Back for episode 4 of Let's Play The Legend of Zelda The Finish Cap! Let's, uh, I think we're gonna get to the boss of the... Ezlo Stop! If you have any hopes of reforging the Sacred Blade, do as the Elder says, go find the Earth Element. What I was going to say before he cut me off is I think we're up to the boss of uh, this dungeon already. So that's nice. I just gotta redo this part. I started from the beginning and not the uh, and not my save state that I saved at uh, last episode. Which me, uh, but uh, the whole dungeon's done and the boss is uh, right near the beginning, so that was easy enough. But uh, we're already in the boss's room and drip, drip. Drip, 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 I can't keep counting anymore. Drip, 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 drip. Plop. Alright. So, uh, apparently this guy is a regular, uh, green choo-choo. But we're tiny now, so that makes him seem larger, I guess. All we gotta do is use the gust jar and do what I just did. Then he jumps around a bit. No, oh, only once this time. I did actually start practicing this uh, this boss before uh, recording, and I died. So. Uh, this actually might be a pretty hard boss for the first dungeon. But I have not taken damage yet, which means I'm playing safer than my practice run of this boss. By the way, uh, today is still March 26th, and uh, this is my third third episode of this Let's Play that I am recording today. Uh, hopefully this one, uh, well, last episode comes out tomorrow on the 27th. Uh, I'm, and this one comes out on the 28th. I'm doing horribly right now. I already lost a full heart. Why am I so bad at this? I thought I was doing so well. But, uh, but yeah, I'm, I'm kind of racking up, uh, this because, um, episodes today. I mean, it's Saturday, and I have nothing to do, and I really love doing this, so, oh god. Am I gonna die? <clears throat> I, I, I took a heart and a half of damage. I don't know how close I am to beating this guy, but... Okay, but like I said, uh, I do love making these videos, so uh, so this is the third video I'm making today, uh, and he's done. But uh, uploading them daily instead of multiple times a day. I are, okay, so I already finished the uh, the boss. That wasn't actually that bad. My practice run was just horrible, but. Uh, you got the earth element. The power of the earth is the source of all living things. The earth element is the embodiment of that power. Okay. Let's uh, grab a heart container. You got a heart container. Your life energy has increased and been replenished. And let's just get out of here before anything bad hap else bad happens. Ah, we've got the earth element. You must go tell the elder at once. Um, so let's head back to Minish, Vill Minish Village, I guess. Guess we have to tell the Elder. First, let's talk to Fastari. You retrieved the Earth Element from the fiend-infested shrine? Incredible! Humans are amazing creatures. The Elder is sure to be amazed, too. I guess let's tell the Elder now. We have nothing else to do, right? That's how to progress in the story, so... Tell the other! 
he told he told us to tell him when we're done finding the earth element. So let's uh, keep his pro uh, keep our promise. So you have found the earth element. You are blessed with mu with much courage and strength for one so young. If your conviction holds strong, head to Mount Cornell. There, you will find a man named Melari. What is with the names of this game? In these games. In this in these in this game. He's the whatever. If you ask him, I'm certain he'll be Ugh! I shall send word to him in advance. Travel safely. You are brave, but there are many evils now in the world. Why did I why why did I just go through that dialogue without actually stopping to read it? Leave through the store here. It will take you out of the forest quickly. Great Elder, we are in your debt. We shall head for Mount Cornell at once. Okay. So, uh, he said this is how to leave the village, right? And we're already outside of the village? That's, that's kind of nice, but there's this tiny house here that we can't go into otherwise. So, green clothes and a mystical hat? Sir, would you be by chance be... Would you, by chance, be Mio P, the one who found the Earth Element? Surely you are. I have heard so many tales about you. I am Bellari, researcher of antiquities. I am also, well, a bit of an inventor. You know, you won't be able to get back to town due to all the debris. Here, I have something that might come in handy. You got a bomb bag! Yay! And it has ten bombs in it. Now you can blow up lots of stuff. Cool! could blow up lots of stuff. You know, until I run out of my ten bombs. Let's uh, get back to normal size. I'm tired of being a minish. And what is... What, what is this thing? Holder of the sacred powers, we grant you the power of wind. And it broke. Whoa! Uh -huh. Whoa! It blew up? Hey kid, look at where that stone marker used to be. There's some strange symbol on the ground. Yes, of course! Why, this must be... Well, I have the foggiest, to be honest. Hmm. Can we get out of these woods quickly? Okay, I do need... I, okay, you actually do need the bombs to leave the forest, apparently. Ooh, I got two mysterious shells. I'm not going to use them for anything, because I don't even know what to use them for. But, uh, I got them. So now we, uh... I guess we make our way back to Hyrule Town? Is that what we're doing? I mean... Let's blow up these. And I got hit, but there is a heart, so... Full health again! Yay! And... Ooh, whoopee. Okay, we're in South Hyrule Field now. Uh, something I want to do... Oh, wait. I saw something. Yes, it's this thing! Holder of the sacred powers, we grant you the power of wind. Hey, that stone marker crumbled, and there's another one of those symbols. You know, no matter how many times I see that happen, it still rattles me. You've only seen it happen twice. Okay, whatever. Alright, next we go to Hyrule Town, I think. I mean, I want to get back to Hyrule Town, I want to do some stuff. And this guy's probably going to stop me. Come one, come all! See how many kinstone pieces you can kill- Oh god, they're- they're all around me. You never know what fusing kinstones will do, but it's sure to do something good. Come on up and get your free kinstone bag for holding your kinstone pieces. Don't miss out on this incredible once-in-a-lifetime opportunity! Sorry, I forgot the accent, or, or the, the- whatever. Yes, yes, you're here for your free kinstone bag, right? That's right, maybe you didn't hear me, but they're free for all kids right now! Alright, I got a kinstone bag. I can now carry kinstone pieces with you. I don't really care. I'm not gonna use them. Press start to view its contents from your quest status screen. It's a side quest, and I really don't know where all of them are, so... Fitting two kinstone pieces together is called kinstone fusion. If you get two pieces to fit perfectly, great happiness will come your way. I'll put a kinstone piece in your kinstone bag so you can give it a try. Anyone who's ready and willing to fuse kinstones will look like I do right now. When you see that look in their eyes, that's when you press L. Use the D-pad to choose a kinstone piece and press A to try fusing it. Did you catch all of that? Yes, I did. Then stand in front of me and press L so we can fuse kinstones. 
Uh, why isn't L working? Okay. Okay! I had to press Q. That's weird. The two kinstone pieces fit perfectly. Maybe something good will happen. Okay, so what happened there was, um, I got soft locked uh, when I tried to record this earlier uh, because my L button on my Switch Pro controller just was bringing up the start menu uh, of the game, or the, uh, of the, like, the, the pause menu. A perfect fit. That means we're both due for a little happiness. See ya. So I was soft locked, so. Uh, I had to ch I had to change my button mapping to, uh, the L button, uh, in-game is now the Q button on my keyboard, so that's weird. I am Swiftblade, finest Swiftman in all of Hyrule. If you train with me, I guarantee that you will increase your skill dramatically. So, would you like to train here? Yeah, please, actually. We shall start with the most basic of all techniques. Ah, oh, thanks. I shall teach you the spin attack. First, press and hold your sword button. Second, build up enough power. Third, release your destructive might. That's all, young swordsman. Do you understand? Yes, I do. Stop giving me that choice, please. Haha, <laughs> very good. You are a very quick student. But one must feel the technique, not just hear about it. That's why I will now possess your body as to demonstrate the technique. I call this the Swift Blade Possession Technique of Training. Watch this! po za shun You know, that name is very, uh, it rolls right off the tongue. The Swift Blade, the Swift Blade Possession Technique, whatever. Phew, now you must try it yourself. Press and hold your sword button, build up enough power. Then, release your destructive might. That's all there is to it. Let's try it for ourselves. We can now spin attack. Yes! Fine work. You're a quick study. I will now give you this tiger scroll. If you ever forget this technique, you can review it with this scroll. You may view it any time from the quest status screen. Okay, I learned the secret spin attack fighting technique, which is amazing. This is the first sword technique you've learned from Master Swiftblade. Alright. Uh... What do I do now? Um, I am going to run quickly and uh, do whatever happened with that kinstone piece earlier. Ow. Uh, Rupee. Can I get a heart? No hearts? Okay. Um, I just want to see what was in here. And ooh, piece of heart! You got a piece of heart. Collect four to make a new heart container for even more life energy. Good thing I came down here, because... Otherwise, I wouldn't have gotten that heart container. I didn't, uh... Actually... know that was there. But, uh... Next thing I want to do in Hyrule Town is apparently talk to the postman. I am the postman, crossing town at incredible spree speed to bring you your mail. Okay, that's... That's not what I wanted to do at all. He was just in the way. He's in the way too. But I do see a wind crest, so... Holder of the sacred powers, we grant you the power of wind. Alright, no, no. Ezlo is gonna say the same thing. Now? Mount Cornell is to the west? So... Random place a bomb, yeah. Ho ho, so you've learned the spin attack? It's still dangerous, but maybe you can handle it. Well, let's see how you do. Show me that spin attack. Okay, I don't want the bomb to destroy me, so I'll do the spin attack over here. Yeah, that's the one. But there are monsters out there, kid. If you just make sure you're careful. I will be. Don't worry. Alright, we are now in the Trilby Highlands. Making my way over to Mount Cornell to the west. And I'm already here, at the base of Mount Cornell. Ah, uh, nope, that's not the way to go. I want this red rupee first. And, that's I, I, that, and that still wasn't the way to go. That didn't lead anywhere. Uh, is this someplace? Alright, it is someplace. Uh, I gotta change to my shield. 
so I can block the nut, so I can talk to the dude. Okay, you got me! I'll make it up to you by telling you something good. A friend of mine in a cave just east of here, in Trilby Highlands, has an item. If you're planning on going up Mount Cornell, I think you might need it. It, it won't get you to the top, but it might just give you a start. Back to Trilby Highlands we go! Um, and I'm pretty sure the friend he's talking about is, uh, ooh, down this ladder here. Uh, but how to get to him is a mystery. Uh, spin attack on this thing? No, that didn't work. Oh, there's a bombable wall. I didn't see that. Oops. Hopefully he's in here. Yes, he is. Uh, hopefully this guy will give me... Hopefully this guy will give me an item that I will need. Okay, you got me. Let me make it up to you. You can have this most deluxe of all bottles for only 20 rupees. So, what do you say, huh? Sure. I got an empty bottle. Use it to store all sorts of things. Thanks a lot. Okay, um... Yeah, so, from my knowledge, you can't make it up Mount Cornell without this empty bottle, for some reason. Uh, we'll find out next time, actually, because we're going to stop here. Uh, I'm going to save, and be sure to like, comment, and subscribe, stay tuned for future videos. Love you all, see you guys later, bye!